At 4.30, the Lord said to me, I am going to give your president a second win. Whoa! Now, this has three meanings. Three meanings. A win, that you will be the president again. And a win, that when an athlete is running a marathon, there's such a thing as a second win. Where you come to a point where you have no energy. I'm an athlete, so I know. You have no energy. I was, anyways. <laughs> Um, I, you have no energy and you feel like you have no strength. But all of a sudden, the, 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 the lungs of this athlete has been trained in high altitudes. Yeah. And because of that, it's, the athlete is able to get so much energy that it's amazing, wins the, and at least finishes, ends, you know, finishes the marathon. This is what the Lord's saying. He says, he has made your, your, your lungs, your body, your spirit, your strength. He has made it in such a way that you have been trained in such high pressured places in the last four years and even before that. And the Lord said, he is ready for the next four years and I'm giving him a second win. Do you understand that? And there's also this, a second win, if you add D, it's the Holy Spirit. And the Lord showed me today, he showed me today that you were coming to get a second wind of a second, uh, another infilling of the Holy Spirit because the Holy Spirit makes you able to finish. Take this to the end, Mr. President. And then he said to me that you were the apple of his eye. And that's what we are, friends. We're the apple of his, of his eye. And then he's protecting you like he is protecting the ancient foundations of our nation. God wants to be in the middle of our nation.